Hello and welcome to this stream of L.A. Noir. This is Jeff and this is the re-release of L.A. Noir. I've been looking forward to this for a long time, so here we go. Sinking data, there's no data to sink. Uh, I played this game on PC a number of years ago and absolutely fell in love with it. And I'm really pleased to see it out on um, Xbox One. So let's see how we go. I'm I don't know how much I'm going to stream tonight, I'm just going to stream the first hour or so of it. Here we go. A city on the verge Here we of go. A new type of city, based not on the man, but on the automobile. The car. The symbol of freedom and vitality. So excited! Where every man Cole Phelps, there he is. <laughs> have room to breathe, not be overlooked by his neighbor. A city where a man's home is his castle. A quarter acre of the dream made possible by victory. <laughs> John Noble there. Dreams. It's been so long. The city of dreams. <laughs> where Hollywood will shape the thoughts and desires of the entire planet. City of Pioneers. Ah, oh, I remember this. I remember all of this. The City of Dreams. <laughs> Dr. Harlan Fontaine. One of the big bats, there he is. Of undercurrents. But not everything is as it seems. A 20th century city that will become a model for the world. Made using subgrade wood. Look at it. Would you want to live in a house like that? A city that has uh. no That will stretch as far as the eye can see. Deal with the chain of command. Mistakes get made, but you deal with them. You know what you're fighting for, and that you're on the same team. But dealing with corruption is like chasing shadows. You never know whether the guy you're talking to is on the path, or whether it's your partner, or maybe even the watch commander. <laughs> so who do you trust, Cole? I made up my mind a long time ago. KGBL calling car 14 Adam. 14 Adam, come in. Go ahead, KGPL. 14 Adam, see the detective an ambulance shooting at 6th and Industrial Street. Get a 16 Williams request <laughs> uniform assistance for an evidence. Just that facial search. expression all the Adam time. Roger, 14 Adam en route. Uh, yes. Here we go again. They don't request uniforms for an evidence search unless there's some kind of catch. Ever the optimist. Uh, From the dream of sunshine himself. There it is. Oh yeah. <laughs> Alleyway crime scene. Floyd Rose, homicide. You might back up? Yes, sir. Phelps and Dunn, Wilshire Division. We had a shooting took place down this alleyway. We have the Vic, Scooter Payton, a Negro male bagged up and on his way to Central Morgue. Witness says a tall white guy, our shooter, put two in the Vic's head and then threw his piece. I need you guys to try and recover the gat. You want us to look anywhere in particular? Give it your best shot, guys. The dead guy's a low life. <laughs> I'm not expecting any miracles here. And if we recover the weapon? Bag it and return it to technical services. You hurry it up, Floyd. We I'm got out of here. To be. Happy hunting. <laughs> He's nice. Ah, uh, yes. Use L to walk. This is a fist hump. Just going through the motions. You're probably right. Let's just get it over and done. All right, have it your way. We'll search right up to the back wall. Hey, if you still don't camera. come up with anything, come find me and we'll talk it out. Two heads are always better well, than neat. one. Swing on the floor over there. Ah, uh, it's been Look so long. This 
Oh, what was that? I think there's something here. It's not my job to pick through other people's trash. There's a paper there. What have you got? Oh, there we are. That's the button I wanted. Oh yes. Dr. Fontaine. Could I have a word? Of course, young man. I really enjoyed your lecture, Doctor. Psychiatry seems to have a tremendous amount to offer. Why, thank you. I'm always happy to receive acknowledgement for my work. The mind is the last great mystery in medicine. Are you thinking of specializing, Mr. <laughs> Sheldon? Or Courtney Sheldon. Oh, I remember him. I'm only in second year, Doctor. They fast-tracked me a year because of my experience during the war. Ah. That's what I wanted to talk to you about. Battle fatigue and collapse under duress. Can it be helped? I would say yes. Hmm. <laughs> Given the right set of circumstances, trauma forces the mind to close down, retreat in on itself. We try to find ways to unlock the mind again through a combination of therapy and drug treatment. Gnosis and therapy are powerful tools in the right hands, Shiv. <laughs> hands not like yours. If you've never played this before, I'm probably beginning to do spoilers because I know what happens. You went through a lot together. Yes, Doc. Give me his details and I'll make a prognosis. I have a number of clinics in Los Angeles, Courtney Sheldon. <laughs> and your penance, or your friend's help, is to come and work at one of them in your spare time. With what little spare time a medical student has. <laughs> is that a deal? Is it ever? I, I can't thank you enough. I'm not promising a cure, Courtney. I want you to remember that. <laughs> Every physician has patients that he cannot hope to cure, for whom he can only smooth the path to death. That's spooky. <laughs> We find out later on who that friend is. I tell you, I'm jinxed. I always get landed with this crap. What about this thing? Cole, come take a look at this. Busy. Much help. Where is he? Oh, look, he's found something. We're never gonna find it. It's a waste of time. Oops. What have you found? He's found... Is that a paintbrush? I'm not sure this means much. Okay. Ah, that's a bloodstain. That's a giant bloodstain. Shooter put him up against the wall and blew his brains out. <laughs> Hell of a way to go. Doesn't really matter how you go once you're gone. <laughs> Don't get all deep on me, Phelps. Okay, if he threw his gun away, oh, press gun to open a notebook. Bloodstain. Oh, that's used. Yes, I remember the notebook. Down here. Hey. Ah, it's on the roof. Ralph, there's something on the rooftop. How the hell did you see that? I looked. <laughs> Reflection in the window. Looks like it might be our weapon. I'm gonna see if I can find a way up there. All right. Don't hurt yourself. And there's a ladder. The gun's up on the roof, right? So we need to find a way up. Oh, there's a drain pipe there. Sorry. Ah, there it is. What kind of chumps do these homicide guys think we are? <laughs> we have a gun. There we go. 
Smith & Wesson, serial S7189. How you doing, Cole? Found it yet? Yes, I found something. Oh, two shots fired. Two rounds fired. And instead of dropping it down a drain, our shooter hoists it up here. Interesting guy. <laughs> We should follow up on this now, before the perp tries to leave town. Yeah, let's make sure of this clue then. Oh uh, yes. I remember this. This is only the first one, we it's only the simple gun, one. Let's take it back to Central, we could get a commendation. We could show some initiative, Ralph. Let's see if we can come up with an owner. That's a <laughs> long shot, Cole. It's pretty fancy guns. You know a local gun store? Sure. There's a place a couple of blocks from here. Okay, use the notebook to set the next destination. This is a gun store. Are you sure about this? It's not really our gig. No. No harm in doing some digging. The suits didn't seem to give much of a damn. Such a little boy scout, Cole. Mm -hmm. You can't wait to get out of that uniform, can you? You'd rather Oops. round up drunks and help old ladies across the road? I'd rather get through the day without the captain's foot oh, my There's head. the bloodstain. It'll be fine, Ralph. You worry too much. Is there anything down here? Oh, that's that thing. And something in the middle of the road here. Now that I've got the controls. Yeah, there it is, just a beer bottle. Wake up, Cole. Coming. I'm just getting used to the controls. Back to the car. Race ya. Ah, uh, you lose. Press Y to enter the vehicle. There we are. Oh, you don't get a map in this, a GPS thingy in this. Yeah. Oh boy. Sorry. We don't need no directions. Whee! Oops, sorry. Ha. Uh. Who taught me how to drive? I don't know. Where is this gun store? Whee! Ah, there it is. There it is. Gun store. Oops. There we go. Officers Phelps and Dunn. Can you tell us anything about this gun? Smith & Wesson. Model 27 registered Magnum. Chambered for 357. Nickel plated with pearl grips. <laughs> Same gun used by General Pat. <laughs> he knows a lot about it. You're not suggesting he's the owner? No, I'm not. You seem to know a lot about the weapon. I ought to. I sold it. You know, this piece will stop a rhino. These babies are only available special order. Ah. Here's my Smith & Wesson order book. You mind if I take a look? Be my guest. This is about something bad, right? Just a bit. Model 27 with pearl grips, Cole. You see it on there? 27... Checkered walnut grip, nope. 27 pearl grip, there, that's one. We're in luck, Errol Schroeder. 203 South Glass Street. Ordered the gun in February 46. Thanks, you've been a big help. Anytime. 
Always happy to help out the LAPD. <laughs> I wish you didn't say that with such a sneer. Right. Do we call it in? Let's see if he's at home. Owning the gun doesn't prove he pulled the trigger. Okay. In for a penny, in for a pound. Let's... Lead the way, Gunga Den. <laughs> Let's have a look at this map, shall we? Uh, what's this down here? Oh, okay. So, you can go that way. Music, I love the music. Oh uh, yes, this is the road I wanted. Music for this is awesome. Jesus! Sorry. Now that wasn't so hard, was it? <laughs> Just because we're in uniform doesn't mean we can't use our initiative. I guess so. Seems a little too good to be true. Ah, boy. No. One of a kind murder weapon bought locally using a real name. If Schroeder's our shooter, he's no criminal mastermind. Most of them aren't. That's why they get caught. Two out of every three cr That's coming out of your way. <laughs> I just mine. knocked his wheel off. Another fact from the Phelps Encyclopedia of Thin Air. <laughs> really are full of them. Oh, it's been so long. Wait, wait, wait. I wonder if this still works. Let's pull up to the side a bit. Uh, options. Display. Black and white on. Sorry about that. Just flick the microphone. There we are. Black and white now. Proper film noir style. So I didn't hear that. Uh, siren. Okay, so it's not this building. It's this building. Is it this building? There it is. Schroeder's apartment, 10.49 p.m. Let's go across the road. It doesn't look too bad like this, actually. Except now I can't see what's a gold door. Hold on, I need to put this back because I can't see what a gold door is. There we go. Ooh, Inspector Mailbox. Schroeder, apartment two. Apartment two. Three, four, two. What do you guys want? Hello. I'm Officer Cole Phelps. This is Officer Dunn, Wilshire Division. You're the owner of a Smith & Wesson Model 27, nickel-plated with pearl grips? I might be. Good, we just found what it. Of it. Then you'll be surprised to know that Scooter Payton was murdered tonight with your gun. You're out of your mind. <laughs> Scooter, he works for me. I have that gun here in my drawer. No, you don't. What the fuck is going on here? <laughs> You're under arrest, Schroeder. Cup him, Ralph. No way. You're not taking me down for this. Oh, boy. Ow. Oh, boy. That was a very bad move, Schroeder. Oh, uh, yes. <laughs> and he's down. Ralph, you all right? 
I'm fine. I hardly felt. He's lucky he caught me off guard. Search the apartment. Keep an eye on him, Ralph. I'm gonna take a look around. Let's see what this thing is. Okay. Floyd Rose. List of names in a series of numbers. Floyd Rose's name is in this book. Phelps, we can come out of this all bright and shiny with a commendation. Or stick our schlongs in a hornet's nest. <laughs> Call it in, partner. And leave the book where you found it. Officer Phelps, badge 1247, requesting. We did it! <laughs> Ooh, flashback. Looks like this is for the war. You dumb fucking sons of bitches, get in this line now before I lose my temper. Excuse me, Sergeant, but... Excuse me! <laughs> Fuck you! You say another word and I'll break your fucking head and have you in the brig. Some of us are here for... I know why you're here, ass wipe. I'm having a bad day, Private. Some people don't seem to want to get on this bus. I didn't ask for your help. He didn't ask for your help. Can you believe this guy? Who are you two? Abbott and Costello? We're here for OCS, Sergeant. So it's the three fucking <laughs> stooges and you're here for OCS. God help this fucking country in the USMC. The Japanese will do the world a favor and kill you quickly. All three of you are on report. What are your fucking names? Phelps. Kelso. Merrill. Any other gentlemen for OCS? Mm -hmm. OCS is at Elliot. You take the Camp Elliot bus over there. This bus is for MCRD. This bus is for men who want to fight. Ouch. 